Okay. So what we want to do is I'm going to take a flat brush and I'm going to take my tint and I'm simply going to, from the center of my moon, wiggle my brush back and forth. It must be horizontal to create that kind of illusion of moonlight reflecting on the water all the way up till it meets the moon. I'm going to do this not a couple times because I want it to be lighter where it meets the moon and then fades as it goes away. So that might require, because we're doing a light color on top of a dark color, that might require several coats. I'm going to let that dry. And then while I'm letting that dry, I'm just going to work on other things as well. I want this moonlight to be kind of blending into the, so again, slightly damp brush to help with that blending. If your base color has dried out, you can always add more. Okay, and then just a little bit of white with my smallest brush, wiggling the brush back and forth like so. And that's kind of how, if you want to have kind of some, you can also have the, the base color cutting in, if you want to add that in as well, so it's not all one white blob. If you start to notice it looks a little bit like a blob rather than reflected light, you can go back in with that base. Okay. And there you go.